Today, we're going to learn how to become faster because speed is such a big important part of football. And because of that, I've teamed up with an actual sprinting coach to give myself and you guys some advice on how to run faster. And in the end, we're going to see if it all worked when I race an actual 100 meter sprinter. Back in the days, I used to be pretty rapid, but then age happened, so I need all the tips I can get. So let's go and meet the coach. My name is Lars Bjørnsen. I'm the sprint coach in Barca Track and Field Club in Copenhagen. Hi, Gemma. First, I need to see you run a yes. few times, okay? And then uh, you can uh, try to improve your speed afterwards. Okay, so I'm just gonna go do it? Yeah, Perfect. let's go. When I saw you start, yeah. your arms were going like this. Okay. okay? So sideways? Have, yeah, sideways. When you go sideways, you're going to rotate and yeah. you're going to put your force outside instead of straight forward. Okay? okay. Two, you have to relax your head. Yeah. Okay. And then you have to push the body a little bit forward. Okay. Okay. You're very straight. Yeah. That means you're going to run with very high knees. Yeah. Yeah. But not, not so much. Okay. No, Just a little bit. Okay. Yeah. Because otherwise, you will get your uh, hip behind you. Watching football matches, do you see that there's like this common trend that football players, they run in the wrong way? Ah, uh, yeah, sometimes I see uh, running with very short steps in the beginning yeah. because I think, okay, I'm gonna go very fast, but you're not moving any because it's very short. So just like a sewing machine, you just step on this in the same place, you yes. know? You have to still increase the steps while you're in uh, accelerating. Any other tips you can give in general to football players out there for, for running faster? Watch uh, track and field guys running on the, on the TV yeah. to see how they're running, especially in slow motion. Mm -hmm. See how relaxed they are even though they are running fast. Mm -hmm. That's the best. So this is the big moment. Any last uh, things you want to say to me to prepare me for, for to not be utterly humiliated? No, good luck. <laughs> good <laughs> Thank luck. you, good man. Luck. Thanks for the tips. Thanks for the tips. So, two good pieces of advice. I need to keep my arms straight and then I need to chill out in my neck and my upper body. But let's see if it works. I'm gonna race a 17 year old sprinter. It's race time. Hi, my name is Tobias Larsen. I'm 17 years old and I'm a sprinter from Sparta Track and Field. We all saw how that went, no need to dive more into that. But the important thing was that hopefully I learned something that I can transfer to the football pitch and become faster than my opponents. And remember guys, it's all about keeping those arms as straight as possible. Chillax in your neck and your upper body and don't forget to take, you know, as long steps as possible. Do like CR7 and you're probably going to be faster. But let me know, what was your favorite piece of advice? Write it down in the comment section and don't forget, train, train, train and you're gonna be faster. Also, don't forget to subscribe, leave me a like if you had a good time, and spread the word by sharing the video with your friends. And with that, I'm signing off. Cheerio. Ugh. Taken to school. What do you know?